Hello everyone, welcome back to another How the Stock Market series here with Jimmy K. For this video we'll be going over the Blackberry stock, uh, ticker is BBRY. Uh, we, this company recently announced its uh, earnings call and it was determined to be a earnings, huge earnings winner, hence why it uh, rose over 21% within the week of this uh, uh, start stock market period in uh, mid-September uh, here. So it was uh, rose from a 9 to mid-90 dollar stock all the way up to currently $11 range. Um, as we can see from the recent uh, Recently, what the stock was traded at, it was uh, f quite a bit down, far down from its uh, initial resistance at the 11 dollars, and it took a huge dip. Uh, the last uh, five or so months. So as we can see right now, it's currently bounced back to its initial resistance level, and it's currently trading within that. Uh, window and it's consolidating right now as we can see it so this company has uh, been consistently announcing its earnings calls and it's been uh, constantly be beating analyst expectations and it's been cons uh, consistently increasing within the market and so now the question is on uh, should this uh, should people start selling out or are people going to start selling out this stock and currently as we can see here within this uh, thinkorswim uh, platform we can see it's uh, reaching the peak uh, resistance levels at 1150 around 1150 and it's been uh, consistently trading within this window here from the $8 range to the $11 range so there's a very likely ability that it could take a dip just because people aren't sure on the future indications of where this stock is projected to um, so it wouldn't be a surprise to see a dip within this stock and for it to bounce back and potentially beat the initial resistance levels at the mid 11s and break through that line so i would say this is a stock to constantly just look out for and see the projections and where it's uh trading at currently it seems to be at a very good uh, valuation and potentially even be undervaluated just be because of its uh, PE ratio, which is cur currently at around eleven dollars, or uh, the PE ratio is at eleven point two nine, so the price of the share is uh, lower than what the company is earning, and this can mean it could be a very good buy potential going forwards. But yeah, I am not saying to uh, trade based on my judgment but go based it on what you guys see is a valuable opportunity to be invested in so yeah this is a stock that i'm currently still looking at and may potentially uh, buy into depending on the, how the company moves forwards with its uh, current uh, earnings call after multiple current winners so yeah I hope you guys uh, all found this video enjoyable and tell me what you guys think on how this stock may play out going forwards and will this uh, break the previous resistances or would it dip back down because maybe people aren't sure of it yet and there's not enough hype behind it so yeah i hope you all enjoyed and please if you enjoyed this video please leave a like and subscribe 
and stay tuned for the next one. Thank you all, and I'll see you all on the next one.